laboring under another bump start against an enemy that broke out of the gates hard, Hill as Pilipinas on Friday night got going in the second quarter and showed why it is one of the best teams in the region these days. June Mar Fajardo didn't show traces of what kind of a shy guy he is on the floor, throwing his weight around when the chips were down for the Filipinos, whom he helped to a 93-71 ripping of Chinese Taipei that put the hosts in danger of missing the second round of the FIBA World Qualifying Tournament. A huge crowd showed up at Taipei heaping gym here and rattled the Filipinos early as Gilas leaned on sheer firepower cohesiveness and size to overwhelm the Taiwanese in the final three periods, winning with plenty to spare and taking a winning feeling going into an interesting return match with Australia on Monday. Coach Chot Reyes was all praises for his fighting 12 for this game, which he described as no quit in this team. He now focuses his sights on the Aussies, who just lost in upset fashion to Japan, 79-78 in Chiba also Friday, which will make the Taipei-Japan match on Monday a KO match for the third and last Group B slot. Team Philippines improved to 4-1 and is already assured of a berth in the second round, and that loss by the Aussies will make the Monday match at Cavernous Philippine Arena one for top ranking in Group B. We came to this game, not even thinking of Monday, Reyes said. Our focus was all on Chinese Taipei, and that's no exaggeration. Now that we are done, I think it, win, will help give us good momentum. But Reyes is wary of what just happened in Japan. They dropped a game against Japan, and for sure, they, Aussies, will come out like wounded tigers on Monday," said Reyes, whose charges lost, 84-68, the first time they clashed early this year. Fajardo came off the bench and fired up the Filipinos a lot, showing emotion early on when he completed a three-point play as Gilas was able to keep the Taiwanese within arm's length. He has every right to demand to start the game, Reyes said of the reigning four-time PBA MVP. But for him it doesn't matter. That's the culture of this team. Fajardo scored 22 points in just under 21 minutes and after that, showed his very taciturn side when he greeted Filipino reporters in the press room with Nahahilla Talaga Eco Dito. Jason Castro scored 15 points, Terence Romeo also came off the bench to shoot 14 and Andre Blatch redeemed himself from a bad outing the last time against Taipei with 13, that went with 12 rebounds and 5 assists. Quincy Davis 3 scored 17 points, Cheng Yulu had 13 and Ying Chun Chan 11 for Taiwan, which got the superb backing from this basketball crazy country that didn't let up in sharing each of their baskets even during garbage time. The scores. Heal as Pilipinas 93, Fajardo 22, Castro 15, Romeo 14, Blatch 13, Norwood 8, Pogoy 8, Wright 6, Rosario 5, Jalalon 2, Abueva 0, Malixi 0, Aguilar 0. Chinese Taipei, Davis 17, Cheng 13, Ying 11, Quan 9, Yi 9, Xin 7, Win 3, Cheng 0, Yu 0, Creighton 0.